Kids How To presents Cheeky Art. Hey kids, look, it's our very own cute furry friend, a dog. Let's draw. Start with the face. And now the body and front legs. Easy and fun. A cute nose. And the big eyes. Let's draw a yummy treat for our friend. Don't forget the ears. And of course, don't forget the tail. Finish off with a nice neat outline. Amazing! And now we colour. Let's colour our dog a light brown. Hey little friend! Let's keep going. To our body now. Aren't dogs your favorite too? They definitely are mine. Let's color his ears with a dark brown. The other one too. Almost done. For the nose, a slightly darker brown. And the tail. Done! Isn't he the cutest little dog ever? Hi kids! Let's begin drawing our cute little cow. Begin with an oval shape for her face. Now a curvy line and two eyes. Yes, that was easy. Draw the pupils and colour them in.
now draw curvy lines for her spots, eyebrows and her horns. And leaf shapes for her ears. Finish drawing the face with a nose and a cute little smile. Let's draw her body starting with her front legs and then her back legs. Now draw the hooves. This looks awesome. Let's finish off with some spots. Draw a cute buzzing bee who is our cow's best friend. Let's begin with the outlining. Here comes the fun part. Let's color her in. Let's use a lovely bright yellow for her face. Oh wow, she already looks amazing. Now let's color her body. Don't forget to stay within the lines. Coloring is so much fun. Let's add some orange to her ears. And to the rest of her face too. Isn't this the cutest cow ever? With a light orange color, fill in the spot. Yes, just like that. And some brown for her hooves. Lastly, a light blue color for her horns. And we're done! Here it is kids, our very own cute little cow. Hello kids, look at this cute little frog. Let's learn how to draw him. A curved line for his mouth. Big round eyes, connect both the sides. Now come the arms, the fingers with circles at the end. The leg and toes too. And just like this, let's draw the other arm and leg. Draw the eyes and some spots on his body. Wasn't that super easy? Let's begin colouring. Let's start with the dark green for the eyes.
and a light green for the face. Hello Mr. Froggy. Let's keep going. Neatly color all over the face. Done! Now, let's color both the arms. Legs This already looks great. Did you know a frog absorbs water through their skin? So they don't have to drink any. And we're nearly done. Fill in the spots with the dark green. And for the bottom of the face too. We can color the rest of his body with a bright neon yellow. What a cute little frog! For the final touches, let's add a neat outline. And a tongue. Woohoo! Here is our friend, Mr. Frog. See you next time. Hi kids! Look, a cute little owl. Let's learn how to draw it. Start with an oval shape. Keep it equal on both sides. An owl has very big eyes, so draw two big round circles. Next the feathers. And ears. And the pupil. Now draw a semicircle and the wings. Yes, just like that. Fill in the semicircle with wide U shapes. These are the feathers. Lastly, let's draw the feet. Let's give it a nice neat outline. Hello Mr. Owl. 
Time to fill you in with some lovely colors. Color in the body with the orange color. Keep going with nice neat strokes. Did you know that the color of owl's feathers helps them blend in with the environment? Let's color the ears now using a brown color. Color in the wings with brown too. Our drawing is turning out great! The rest of the feathers can be coloured with peach. over the use with peach too. This makes the features stand out. Now let's finish off with yellow for the nose. And yellow for the feet too. The owl is complete. Great job kids. Hope you had fun drawing. Hey kids. What do you find in the sea? A fish? A whale? A shark? Let's make a shark today. Let's make an eye. Its fin. A curvy line and its white, sharp teeth. Don't forget to make the bubbles. Let's give a dark outline to our shark. Let's use light blue for the mouth area. I love the color blue, don't you? Let's use a dark blue paint color for the body. Isn't it looking wonderful? Ooh, I love painting. I 
and it's almost done. Time to paint the fins. Let's draw the shark's gills with some lines. Little dots in the bubbles. Ta-da! Our shark is ready to swim in the sea.